We are introducing the Singer Stitch Sew Quick Handheld Mending Machine. Your purchase includes the mending machine, three additional threaded bobbins, three additional machine needles, needle threader, and spindle. Within your instructions manual, you will find a detailed parts diagram which clearly labels the following parts. Set screw, tension control, needle arm, thread guide, on-off switch, adapter input, battery compartment, rotary wheel, bobbin, fastening plate, and thread guide. We will now load the batteries to demonstrate the functions of the machine. Make sure the device is in the off position prior to placing batteries. Replace all four AA batteries as a simultaneous set. Do not mix alkaline with standard carbon or zinc batteries. Now we will proceed with replacing the Class 15 metal bobbin. To thread the stitch so quick, pass the thread through the eyelet on the needle arm, then pass over top of tension control. Do not wrap completely around tension control. Pass needle threader with inserted thread through the eye of the needle from back to front. Lastly, remove needle threader. Use your left hand to hold the cloth and to control the direction and speed as the machine will feed cloth to the left. Be careful not to rush the machine or pull the material through the device too quickly. When wider stitches are required, pull cloth to the left a little faster while you continue sewing. Follow the center line on the cloth fastening plate to ensure straight stitching. If stitching is too tight, turn tension control slightly to the left. If stitching is too loose, turn tension control slightly to the right. When finished sewing, Raise the needle arm to the highest position by turning the rotary wheel. Then use the back of a seam ripper or scissors to pull the thread out about 3 inches and cut thread. Turn the rotary wheel, lowering the needle into the cloth, and continue to turn the rotary wheel until the needle arm is again at its highest position. Lift the fastening plate and take off the cloth to the left, making sure not to pull the thread as the seam will unravel. Turn to the back side of the cloth and guide the reserved 3 inches of thread to make a knot. First, pass threader through the last stitch. Pull thread through threader, pull out about 1 inch and guide the thread through the loop and pull it tight to finish the knot. To replace needle, loosen the set screw with a screwdriver and take off the old needle. Always use a standard sewing machine needle. Needle must be installed with flat side of needle shank facing the front of the stitch so quick. To install a standard thread spool, remove spindle and take off the bobbin. Ensure spring is in place before installing bobbin. Insert extension spindle with spool into the machine hole. Now that you know how to use your stitch so quick, you are ready to sew. Maybe you need to fix a hem quickly, or perhaps you want to start a fun new project. These are some examples of finished projects. Refer back to the instruction manual for additional operations details.